Alright, hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome to Dead Cells. So this is the demo version, uh, let's see, an alpha build whatever. So Dead Cells doesn't come out for about a week and a half. It comes out on May 10th, and it looks awesome. It's a roguelike metroidvania, which uh, could either be really bad or really awesome. I've always... Okay, so we are cells, and now we are... Okay, that was kind of gross, but cool. Can I get the headsman's axe? Okay, so main weapon, I've got like a, a daggery thing. And I've got a dodge roll. Okay, so far so good. Yeah, most of the time I see, um... Oh, we do have a double jump. That's useful. And yeah, most of the time I see, uh... Oh, I can just... Uh, yeah, most of the time I see people trying to attempt this, it usually doesn't go great. So let's, let's see if this one does well. You wouldn't be the headless guy now, would you? Thumbs up. Uh, what? Cat got your tongue? Ah, yes, the tongue thing. A bit strange to be back amongst the dead, no? I mean, you've surely noticed. You can't die. I don't really know why, but you're not the first to be staring down the barrel of immortality, if you were wondering. Okay. You can do better than this. Okay, so beginner's bow. Uh, DPS. Ammo 5. Oh, that's a problem. Secondary weapon only. The Jailer's son was getting pretty good at hunting rats with this. And good old wooden shield. Blocks attacks. Second, secondary weapon only. Okay, so this to block. Oh! So we can either block or... Okay. Alright. Well, looks nice so far. Okay. So we can dodge underneath him if I'm paying attention. Hello, Mr. Archer Man. Okay, you can stun lock them. Let's check this out. Ice bomb, so that's one of the random ones. Camera controls are a little bit fiddly. And, uh, it's, it moves over a lot. Okay. Ooh. Assault shield. Okay, so I could get rid of the rusty sword, or the... Let's... Let's go with the wooden shield. Yep. Oh, that's interesting. So I don't know if it blocks. I just shield slam a dude. Well, maybe I shouldn't be trying that anyway. Eh, let's try the st sturdy shield. Oh. Huh. I, did I not bust that? No, I must have actually opened that that door for once. Okay, and we get a grenade. Yeah, so if the camera's uh, stuck to the character a little bit better, I think I'd be down with it. It gets a little bit uh, swoopy. Okay, teleporter. You haven't unlocked another teleporter yet. And treasure found. Let's check this one out. We get kunai. Throwing knife 2. 16 damage per second causes bleeding. Attack automatically targets the closest enemy. Uh, oh. Ooh, let's cancel that. I don't like limited ammo for anything. And, it, oh, rub? I don't know if I should be rubbing this, but I'm gonna rub the hell out of it. Come on. You know what to do. No, I guess not, actually. He really doesn't know what to do. Oh, that's unfortunate. Uh, let's see. I guess let's just go straight down. So it doesn't look like there's much uh, much verticality, which is unfortunate. Oh! Increase active sk skill damage and reduce their cooldown. Okay. So that's neat. And for a thousand gold, we can get through there. Well, we're actually getting kind of close to that. Yeah, I was hoping there would be like a, a downward attack. Sort. Oh, door's blocked. And they're firing bombs at me. That's not- oh! There is a down attack. I just have to press the right button. Okay. Ah! Ah! Yeah! Okay, there we go. Door open, and I forgot to dodge. Okay, we have taken some hits here. Okay. I don't know if that guy can shoot me from back- uh, from backing up there and whatnot. The one unfortunate part is the a lot of the level chunks feel maybe a bit on the, uh... Okay, I'm gonna go for this guy first. There we go. Okay, yeah, there's plenty of warning when they're gonna attack you. What's this? Blue... Blueprint acquired bloodbath. And... Electric whip. Ooh. Ooh hoo hoo. Okay, that looks fun. Yeah, so the level design is a little bit basic. 
But that's not necessarily a bad thing. Okay, we do have the thousand gold. Do we want to go back? Uh, ooh, we've got a merchant here. It just doesn't look like I can get back. Not Im immediately. So let's go back up to the, this power, power scroll for the time being. Okay. Now let's, let's go grab our Mega Man power up or whatever. Alright, and choose one stat to improve. Okay, so health, strength, or skills? Let's do strength. I haven't even figured out how skills even work in this game. Hopefully we unlock stuff like a, a wall jump and stuff like that. Uh, let's see, it doesn't look like I have anywhere else I can go. Me Castlevania now. This is very, <laughs> this is very Castlevania. -y. I mean, it is a Metroidvania, just with roguelike mechanics. Okay. Ah! They're bombing me. Well, at least the merchant doesn't seem to give a damn. Smacky, smacky, smacky. Ah! Smacky, smacky, smacky. Ooh, greed shield. Break the tooth of your enemies when you parry. All right. Smacky, 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 smacky. Ow! Okay. There we go, so I can get around him. Unfortunately, we're wounded. Is there anything I can do? Oh, skills. So, oh, active ability charges. Oh, so my bomb, my bombs are the skills. Oh, haha! <laughs> All right. So apparently, um, skills skills do not have limited quantity, uh, like I'd originally assumed. Well, that's kind of handy. Hey, we get a power scroll. I guess I should probably upgrade my health. Maybe they'll give me a little bit more maximum. Eh, not too much. All right, I'm actually really digging this game. Uh, like I said, the level design. Maybe. Ooh, carrot. Yes. We got munchies. Wait, tickle. There's endless tickling. I don't think it... Yeah, I don't think... I'm tickling the whatever the hell this is, and it is... I don't know if it's liking it or not. But it does not seem to... Uh, it doesn't seem to do anything, which is unfortunate. I love the, skilling, uh, the skills here. Okay. This is this is neat. I, I'm curious about um I'm curious about uh how much further this game goes. Oh, there's some kind of freaky beating heart thing. And a treasure chest. Hey. Alright, let's see what we got. Okay, bear trap. Active ability immobilizes target. Let's pick up instead of ice bomb. Uh let's get it instead of the grenade. Being able to an immobile like, being able to immobilize my strong enemies. Probably a good idea. Okay. We should... Get past. Okay. I might see if I can remap my controls so, um... My dodge button is not... Uh, on the same... Like, it's not the same finger as attack. Okay. Uh, let's, let's do... Let's do some strength. I gotta whip people. I don't know what those, like, orby things are. Oh, nope, nothing to worry about. Okay, so we're actually done with the area. I might have been able to do something with a merchant, but I kind of doubt it. Uh, you look like a boss. Well, look at who it is. They call me the Collector. I guess I'm about the closest you'll get to company down here. In exchange for the cells you are collect from your enemies, I can give you a few useful items. If you get your hands on some blueprints, I'll see if I can put together a few more experimental items. Okay, so we can invest in healing potion one. Oh, yeah, let's invest some cells in that. Okay, permanent improvement unlocked. You now own a health flask you can use at any time. Okay. Uh, let's see, six cells, 25% of your gold when dying, or bloodbath, weapon, causes bleeding. Uh, let's do gold recovery for the time being. Okay, so random starter bow, random starter shield. Hopefully they have a lot more of these like little tr uh, talents than, th than uh, just that amount. Maybe unlock more as you go along. Anyway, everything you buy here is yours forever. Even death can't take it from you. Let's just say that. If you want more power, you should bring me more cells. So, now we've got a prisoner. Right. Now, out of my sight, prisoner. Your presence here grows tiring. Okay, so I can heal. 
But it's empty. So we have to wait for it to charge back up. Might be time-based, might be otherwise. Let's see what this is. So, oh, this recharges our health flask. Okay. Oh, and health restored. Well, that's handy. Uh, I guess before we go too far, let's do... Okay, it was making weird sounds there. Okay, now that's the ramparts. Okay. Oh, that's the sound effects. Okay, so we want to do roll as right trigger and right skill as B. Okay. So I should be much more inclined to uh, dodge now that I can, uh, now that I don't have to worry about button placement. Okay. Ooh, this looks neat. Kind of reminds me of Sultan Sanctuary. Okay. Ow. Well, I said I was going to start dodging more often. That was a damn dirty lie. I also missed. Sprinter! <laughs> and we're getting a lot of cells here. Hopefully, maybe cells carry over. That'd be nice. Ah! Ah! Yeah. Okay. We get whatever this is. Blueprint acquired. Lightning bolt. Okay, oh right, blueprints Blueprints are how we get the extra traits. That's that's what it was, now that I'm paying attention. Okay, so I can go up, but we haven't visited anywhere else. Oh right, okay, um... Was my background peeking out slightly? Really? Shouldn't be. Oh, it is, that's weird. Huh. Does this game just not fit? That's very odd. Okay, give me a second. Scale filtering, full screen projector, properties transform. Uh, fit to screen. It's supposed to be. Oh, because it's low res. Okay, that would make sense. Well, it doesn't look like it can go back this direction. It doesn't look like rubbing that thing does anything. Well, that's unfortunate. I've kind of fixed the problem. I'm sorry about that, everybody. I don't know if that's going to make it to YouTube. It's kind of one of those minor ed edits that I sometimes forget to deal with. Okay, uh, let's go this direction first. Oh. That is really satisfying. Mario stomping the shit out of people is great. Oh! Okay, so his shield... Okay, there we go. His shield will, um... His shield will actually block my my spells and abilities. I gotta find some stuff that's uh, less blockable. I appreciate that. I also appreciate the fact that my whip attacks uh, in a diagonal. That is really smart game design as far as I'm concerned. Ow! I was gonna see if I could go over it. The answer is no, you can't go over that. Looks like there's a big old pit here. Oh, right. I got a double jump for a reason. Let's see. Does jumping bring us up faster? It doesn't look like it. I want, I want a wall jump. I want a wall jump bad. It'd be nice if I could unlock that. Like if I could unlock like a double or a triple jump. Ow, oh. Whip. And off I go. Oh, oh. I'm not dead. That is good. I was worried about that for a second. So apparently going down the infinite pit is damage, nothing more. Frost bomb is ridiculous. Especially with all the whipping that I get to do uh, as a result. Okay, uh, let's go down. I wonder if there's another thing I want to do. Uh, let's see. Miscellaneous, roll cooldown, feedback, hide controls, attack warning. Now, I was hoping there would be a way to turn off like V-Sync or something. I think we're getting a bit of a screen, whatever. Door was closed six minutes ago. Too bad. Oh, it's because I'm going too slow? Really? Well, that's interesting. Yeah, this whip is ridiculous. Unfortunately, when I die, I think I'm going to lose it. Eh. 
We got a portal here, which probably means maybe a boss? Nope. Maybe this is a boss. Ah! Oh! What? I died. And lost 14 cells. That sucked. We got- we got desecrated hard. Oh, that was bad and gross. Alright, so we're here again. We get to keep a little bit of our stuff. Yeah, so... This is weird. Okay, Fallen Warrior sack. So we get some of our gold back. That is not much. Doesn't seem to be going all that well for you now, does it? Have you noticed how everything seems a little different each time? You almost think this island was alive. Ridiculous, really, don't you think? Alright, see you later, dude. Okay, so we're reset back. Potentially to this area. I guess let's go... Ow. Oh, that didn't work. Oh, okay, so ammo does... Ammo does recover, so I might start doing this. It just looks like it's on a bit of a delay. Well, that's nice. I don't like having to manage those things. Oh, I can just duck. Oh, or not. Huh. Well, that makes it a little bit easier. I wonder if, uh, dodge rolling... Uh, works particularly well. Okay, I'm gonna go strength. I missed my whip already. That thing was awesome. Oh, it's okay. I might, uh, seeing as we got the money, I think I'm gonna get the blood sword. Uh, upgrade. To start off with. That, that'll that probably be useful. Maybe lightning bolt. We'll see. But yes, this is very defi definitively based on, like, Castlevania and whatever. Which is awesome. I, I think they actually... Okay. Takes a while for that to cool up. I think they actually kind of nailed the design here. Like, it's a little clunky, but I can deal with it. Electric whip! Yes! Okay, join the dark side. Great. Okay, treasure found. Unfortunately, this first level feels a little formulaic. Kind of the same stuff every single time. I wonder if there's... I mean, obviously, it changes a little bit, but... Okay, so I can I can use ground stomps, but it looks like uh It looks like ground stomps generally only do damage if you've actually got some height to work with. Ooh, new dagger. I'll get that in a second. Gotta gotta get this. So we've got daggers here. Let's pick it up. Um twin daggers. Inflicts critical blow on the third consecutive hit. Let's try it. Okay, it looks cool. We'll give it a go. I guess the other option is I might actually be able to have uh, both. Let's keep going strength. Let's let's swap out the bow because I'm not going to be using the bow. All right. So now we got whip and daggers. Still don't know what this does. This is reminding you of Rogue Legacy. Yeah, honestly, it actually seems like they've kind of mushed together uh, a ton of different genres. How do I get up there? Oh, you teleport. You teleport between the rubbable things. Okay. Okay, that does damage. And stuns, and hello. Hey! Strength. Like that? Okay. So that's just bear trap again. We don't really care about bear trap. Yeah, so the double daggers do stupid damage, comparatively. Looks like we're also getting... Crazy trapped here. Oh, we're getting... We are getting small amounts of health. Uh, health drops from enemies. Unfortunately, it's hard to tell because my Nintendo Switch keeps showing up in front of my user interface. Okay, so we got Double Dagger. Not that useful. Shields, not that useful. Frost Blast. Okay, let's... Oh... Goodbye, Electric Whip. You were awesome. But I am here to try out new things that we should save. Oh, wait, no. Save ourselves. Okay, so this is the throwing knife, too. Oh. Well, I can chuck it pretty quick. Uh, 
Never mind, never mind on any of these things. Well, this is fine. Where, where are we going? Right, wasn't there an entrance to the rampart somewhere? Over here? Yeah, here we go. So let's see, is... Okay, it's this guy's time again. Well, well, you're back. Alright, so... Can use our healing flask two times. 40% of our gold. Well, for starters, let's get the... Let's get the blood bath. Okay, so we've gotten blood bath. Increases the damage bonus. Let's see, unlock nine more items. Yeah, some of the, the these are gonna get expensive. I guess let's uh, invest cells in the thing. Okay, so this does 90 damage a second. Damage plus 20%. Enemies explode on death. Freeze effect for 20 seconds. Huh. It's a weird weapon. I think I'm gonna go with it just because that special effect seems useful. Versus just two knives. I think the knives still do more t uh, do more damage, but to some degree we're looking for like useful things. It looks like it does a ton of damage, but the uh, twin daggers actually do more da uh, more damage than this. Spent a bunch of money for frost blast. You never even used once, dude. Then whatever. Money, money is no object right now. We want cells. I wonder if I can... Oh. I found a secret amethyst. Okay. Kunai! Yeah! Okay. Oh, wait, what? Wait, was I... Was I checking kunai? I really need to figure out how the kunai work. In this game. I think I was... I think I was able to huck them through the... The floor. Okay, so this guy... Sucks. But it's not the end of the world. Okay, greed... Shield. Not that useful. What do we got on this... The uh, rooftops here? No idea, we've got another secret amethyst. They're not actually that hard to find. Okay, what do we got to... Ooh, treasure found! We get... What do we get? I need to remember to use my grenade. Okay, stunning grenade. Well, speaking of, skills plus one, inflict 39 damage, stun nearby enemies for three seconds. That's everything about that I like. I'll try the frost blast later. We just immediately found something better. Oh, right. Doo -doo ah. Holy shit, this guy hurts. Oh, no. Does this do the Bloodborne thing? This does the Bloodborne thing. Where, uh, if you hit enemies... Uh, if you hit enemies after taking damage, uh, you actually heal back up. I was wondering about that. Gotta re yeah, gotta remember to use these skills way more often. They look kind of amazing. Minute and a half ago. Eh. I don't care too much about speed. Someday we'll get one of those, maybe. The problem is I'm very slow and methodical. Okay, so this means we've got an elite enemy up ahead. So this might kill me again. But that's okay. Is it the archer again? Ah, just getting close to him sucks. And we lose four cells. Well, that... Maybe I should get a shield. Okay. Oh, it's the same thing again. This this is going to be great when the collector manages to fill all of these flasks. You're behind this, right? Ah, yes, of course. You're working on it. Like all the rest I see. Okay. Let's take the beginner shield, I guess. Uh, how do we how do we get these? Who are you? I know what you did. We. I'm not writing I'm noting them down in my little book. That's my job. You've been killing things, I see. Okay, game stats coming soon. Well, never mind on this. So how do I how do I pick up my powers or do we have to get them later? I have no idea. What is going on? 
Yeah, I think I might stay away from the elite enemy for a little while. Oh. Just because it seems like it might be a good idea to just progress and get some more cells inst instead of just killing myself repeatedly. I just wish I had that, like, sword thing. Okay, so we get grenade one. I was, I was expecting that, like, blood, blood sword looking thing was actually going to be something I could uh, start with forever, but it looks like it does something different. Not entirely sure. Oh, health increased. I guess that's not the end of the world. We do, I mean, more bonus health actually might lead us to not sucking or getting killed by that one guy, because as long as I can survive it, we're good. Okay, ice bomb, my favorite. As long as I remember to use it. So we do get stunned if we fall fall too long. Oh, okay, so the grenade did not stop him. Good to know. Ah. Oh, that's okay. Let's open this. Cannot open it from here. Okay, so I, I did jump over that. Oh, and we found a secret amethyst. Right. Secret amethysts actually show up here. We are wealthy. Hello, grenade. Oh, there's a stun bomb there. Can I get to that? There might be like a secret way. Can I bust my way through here? No, so there's got to be there's got to be a different way to get through here. I wonder if you need to hold the button for the rubbing, or does it not work that way? Nope, I'm just very good at just mashing, mashing buttons. Okay, so this is, this is the assault shield. Actually, you know what? We're gonna pick up the assault shield. The assault shield might actually be, uh... Might be a way to... Might be a way to get to this guy. Okay, did I get to him? Okay. There we go. Got him with the freezing. And we get Electric Whip 3. Which does even more damage. Okay, cool. Anything else in here? No. Well, there's, there's our first elite enemy down. Probably didn't need to do that, but we're okay. Yeah, as long as you can get to them, they're not actually half bad. Okay, so let's get some strength here. And what's this? Oh, okay. Tribute for a skill point. I'll take skill points. Okay, there we go. I, I will say... Ow. Me. Ow. Let's see. Didn't get him. Didn't get him. Okay, I do have grenades though. Yeah, I have to figure out how that works. Oh, that's okay. Uh, let's just keep going through. Is it just me or is this level getting more complex? I have no idea. Okay, Jade Talisman. Pendants don't take up a gear slot, but you can only equip one at a time. So skills plus one. Daggers and sturdy shield. Uh... I don't care too much about gold. So let's buy this one for the time being. Okay. It doesn't... I like the teleportation system in this game, it just... I'm not entirely sure if it does... us much good, at least not right now. It'd be nice if you could teleport whenever you want, but still. Okay. But yeah, no, I, I'd like to try Frost Blast. Okay, so I don't... I don't have any cells. No, I have, like, 12. I'll work on the gold thing, and then I'll probably work on the healing thing. Okay, there we go. It's actually, like, a pretty solid game. Oh, there was a secret there on the wall. I don't think I can go with that, though. That would, it would be possible? I don't know. I will admit the roguelike mechanics might get a little bit tiring after a certain point. 
The nice part is we don't, uh, we are getting, like, upgrades as we progress here. So, like, even if, uh... Even if it, uh, takes a little while, we're going to be badass eventually. Hello, what are you? Found a rare blueprint, bow and infinite ammo. I suck at rolling underneath those. Oh, that's okay. Oh, I should probably try using the shield. I wonder if it blocks attacks while, while approaching enemies. I don't know that one. Let's see. So yeah, story. I have no idea what this game's story is. I don't even know if they're going to try and have much of one. But yeah, gameplay is pretty much just platformy. I mean, if you've played like uh, any other like Metroidvania, it kind of fits in the same... Vein. Okay, so let's get Ice Bomb 4, Strength plus 1, Enemies Explode on Death. Seems useful. Mild temptation to actually get two Frost Bombs, though. Yeah. Ow. I saw it coming and I did nothing. Okay, we do get a Sturdy Shield. Attacking immediately after parry inflicts 300% damage. Kind of handy. I don't know. I'm not... I'm not entirely sure about blocking and whether or not it's going to do us much good here. Okay. Press the healing button. Like a dunce. Okay, well, might as well get this. Ow. Maybe I should have... Ah! I didn't realize they'd follow me in that, that manner. Oh, that's okay. Uh, let's see. So we've got the weird priest guy. Nope, missed him. You messed up. Yeah, if they end up behind, uh, below me, we're super golden. Okay. Okay. Got him. Just gotta go over those guys. A little bit leery about. Damn it! Oh, we did kill the shield guy though. That's that's handy. Oh, hi, Ruby Talisman. You can get gold. Wait, hold on. Pendants. You get gold when you get a dead cell from an enemy. Oh. Eh, it's kind of useful. Okay, question. Can I take my portal back? So I can only, I can only portal between locations. I guess it helps a little bit. I was hoping that I'd be able to, um... Okay. Okay, can't do that. Thirty-eight elite. Unfortunately, his infinite spawning little goons make it a lot harder. Out, and he hurts. Got him. Did I get him? No, I didn't get him. He just he just berserked. Ah, uh, let's see. Uh, oh, we stunned him. I I guess he blocked for too long or something like that. Anyway, we could get a throwing knife one. Yeah, let's get the throwing knife one over the assault shield. Or four. Or five. Over the assault shield. Can I smack him through the wall? No. What about a grenade? No. Well, I tried. Ow. Ow. No fair. No fair. Ah! Got me ahead of time. Unfortunately, we have no more healing potions. I wonder if it triggers it. Well, option A. We just gun for the side and see if we can find, like, a healing something or other. And just explore nothing. Oh, thank you. Increases health by one. Yeah. 
Yeah, gotta use my skills more often. Okay, Bloodbath 3. Oh, so that just means we've unlocked it. Okay. Bye. That's handy. Okay, I'm just gonna hang out here for a second. We're still very much in the doghouse. But I've got explosions that I can rely on. I just wish they drop health more often. Ah! What the? Ah! God damn it! I keep jumping over those arrows and it doesn't do anything and I lost 21 cells. Oh, wait. Does that mean I don't lose all of them? No, I lose all of them. Son of a 